feelings, your thoughts based on these two lineups. Is it obvious that Masha uh, on Kulawash was kind of forced? Is, is he, did he run out of heroes? Did did yeah. just, did Bren do this? It it took him a while to decide to. It took them for the draft to decide Arcadia to decide that. Mm, Masha, Masha. Yeah, Masha. All right. It sucks, I know, but this is what we have proved to be the game changer for uh, Sunsparks. So I'm not uh, going to count him out just yet. Again, if you're uh, wondering what's going to happen to these teams uh, if they lose, they will drop down to the lower brackets waiting for their opponents. In the lower bracket finals, that's going to happen uh, tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Okay, Best match is underway. Time. Here we go. Look at this. Kilowash just bullying two people out of their own orange buff as EJ it. comes in. Oh, he gets it. And tells him, oh, he gets it. But first blood is drawn and Carl Tizi picks the back the buff right back up. I mean, he's got three health bars, all, all things considered. But, you know, it's a bit too greedy on uh, Kilowash's side. And this is a sign that, hey, we did not really want to go for the Masha. And because of that, that's just a huge opening there. As I say that, JP takes out Lussy. Zero to a hundred. One for one. Yeah, one for one so far. And look at this. They left the purple buff up, Nomad. The purple buff is up for Carl TZ to take. But this fight is going to extend. It's still happening. Down goes Few. JP gets the finishing touch on that. And, uh, yep, they're still going. JP's going to... It's just so hell-bent on stealing this purple. But wait, Rafflesia looking low. Flickers out with the ball and that's a disengage and we're back to a relatively normal game now um bit of a scuffle a lot a long-term scuffle there in the bottom bottom jungle and the top jungle for the buffs i didn't think that that was completely necessary for uh sun sparks but they managed to come out on top with two kills uh, to their name uh quickly trading out the death by kilowash now it all is gonna boil down to objective takes here because Masha can melt down turrets and as I say that TZ will not be able to survive oh. the onslaught of kicks that JP delivered. No, it's his kicks and JP's blades. Oh, there you go, there you go. Yeah, yeah there you go. Easy. Switched yeah. it up. Yeah. So switched it up, but matter of fact, is Carl died there. Rebo here looking low. Where is Rebo exactly? There you go. Going up against Kiel and Kiel gets the kill. <gasps> Kiel survives! That turret blast, you see that? That was one turret blast, could have been lethal. One HP and a dream for him. And the dream happened, gets the knock up onto EJ. EJ, fettered airstrike though, will not be enough to at least secure a kill, but it deters everybody from taking down JP, and JP's gonna be relegating himself back into the jungle. Yep, securing his own purple as Kilowash here rotates into mid, now back into bottom. Rafflesia bullying Lusty out. Of position, they are going to secure this Litho Wanderer. Nice. Ooh, wow, JP blocking, yeah, blocking the arrow so that they can still take the Litho Wanderer, and he was uh, actually confident that there would be no follow through. Amazing, big brain move. And as I say, that big uh, rage there onto EJ, no uh, follow ups with the teammates just yet. Feathered airstrike, greed is wide open. Call TZ, yeah, but he's got the support yeah. though. JP uh, going up against uh, Rebo. Nice uh, Guardians Barry there onto Rafflesia. Gets the stun connection. The Abyssal oh! connection. There goes the burst down onto EJ and to Rebo. And JP just gets out of there. Man, the Wombo combos are happening, Nomad. 1 to 6 currently. 4,000 gold ahead. Full combo from Carthese. Way of the Dragon with all of his kit. Onto Kilowash. Kilowash running for dear life. There's the flicker. Confirmed the kill. Lusty gets Kilowash out of here. But Lusty sacrificing himself to the turret. Man, can you imagine if Kilowash got like at least one love tap onto Lusty? He would have scored a kill. But, you know, que sera, sera. Oh, yeah. few though. Oh, here VJ. Uh, he does not have the Falling Star to follow it through. But Greed is painful. Top lane turret is gonna go down as well. It was cru it, that was also a crucial miss by uh, Kilowash with the second skill. Uh, if or if it connected, it's uh, going to be Carl TZ not being able to attack him. Norm go go for the normal attacks for a good two seconds, and that's enough time for Kilowash to escape with more HP. Mm-hmm. 
And now it's uh, dual as old as time down bottom. Two fighters just uh, going toe to toe. And yeah, Karatezi is going to take this turret. And th that's the best he could ask for. But Kilowash has a huge wave to deal with. There's Greed with uh, the uh, disengaged Feathered Airstrike. They're not ready to take his fight just yet. Oh, false armor oh. to EJ though. And KLVJ diving in. JP as well. There's a little bit of the Lepaku going on Man. there. Man. Greed is like, hold your breath. This is not what you think it is. We're actually going to pick the fight and they get EJ into the back lines there. And this is a healthy enough minion wave to actually confirm a kill. Rafflesia misses the hop, but it's enough to space out Brandy Sports as they take this tier one turret in mid. And they are pushing it forward. Turtle's going to be secured as well by JP. He's going to have the turtle buff. He's going to have a lot of damage going in. Greed turns into a little birdie and runs away. KLVJ just working up top, clearing that wave. EJ throws out the Guardian's Barrier. Arrow by Lusty. Misses. Nothing but net there. Few though. 2v1. And it's not the kind of 2v1 we were used to seeing in game one. Rafflesia to the rescue here. KLVJ catches a five second arrow from Lusty. Preparing a falling star moon. There you go. The engage happened. Kilowash here gonna go down. That's an off camera kill though. What? Kilowash survives! And up top, it's actually where Sunsparks is losing. Kill VJ 2v1 against EJ and Lusty. Rebo here to the rescue, throwing out some flames of his own. Now Lusty gonna go down. JP gets the final touch. EJ here just barely surviving. Oh! The wild swing takes out Rafflesia. And look at this, up top and down bottom. It's a mirror move. Kilowash and JP gonna push their own respective turrets. That's the best that Sunsparks could have asked for. Despite losing Rafflesia, they still come out winning. I'm questioning the uh, early corrosion scythe here. Uh, typically, you see a Demon Hunter sword being picked up by a Masha, uh, just so because just because that the Demon Hunter sword will vibe well with the life steal that Kilowash has, uh, that Masha has with the passive. So, really, a the Demon Hunter sword is the the best pick for that. But I guess the Corrosion side also works well in terms of just being able to tear down turrets, I guess. Yeah, and it, it's got attack speed and it's got the bite. It's got the slow. So I think that's what Kilowash wants. He's able, he wants to be able to keep fights up long enough for his allies to come in. So look at this EJ getting trapped inside with the wild charge to run away. But Greed says, no, man, you stay where you are. Oh, really? That is where you fall right there underneath your own turret. Now, Rebo does not have any Faraga armor, but does have his immortality up. And, wow, Kilowash just steals the orange buff. Like a thief in the night, they're out. And the last turtle of the game gonna go here to JP. No questions asked. And objectives are now lacking here for Brand Esports. Um, they need to find a way to push out. And they need to control JP for that matter. Uh, Esmeralda's just gonna do... Uh, KLVJ's just gonna, just gonna do his job and start pushing in uh, the top side. Rejoin the fight once he secures the turret or rejoin the fight once a kill will be secured and that will in turn make Kilowash the primary uh, split push here goes for the falling star moon almost takes Ooh. down almost takes down EJ there the bottom lane is being aggressively pushed up by Kilowash and the corrosion side is now finally paying oh. off as they secure the kill onto few greed low Grid. on HP being chased down by Carl TZ. nice G Kundo oh. and Shunpo to secure the kill and that is going to be a complete disengage with Rafflesia looking at Carl TZ. JP's gonna be here as well Rafflesia does oh. have the bouncing ball available not gonna need it anymore as I say that top lane though kill VJ looking in uh, to kill Lussy here Rebo trying bursting kill VJ down to low HP does not have any means to escape no minions uh, pushing in. He could go for the top lane and he oh, managed to escape. Rafflesia. Rafflesia jumps in, bouncing balls uh, out of there just to ensure the safety of his teammate. And mid lane is going to be sieged up once again. What a juggle by KLVJ. That really could have gone so wrong in so many ways if he did not go out the way he did. But look at that, waiting for the minion wave, waiting for Rafflesia to come in, and then eventually going out. Now, is this a death bush here by Sunsparks? EJ using the wild charge to disengage. That's just two members, but look, all four are afraid. EJ might go down here, but KelvJ could not get the final touch. Greed tried to help, but could not finish the job. Now, Rebo with the last insanity. Oh, still fighting. He's fighting, oh. he's still fighting, he turned! I think they're gonna pop the emo. They're gonna pop the immortality. There you go. Yeah, that's that's a good turn by Kill VJ. 
He didn't have to uh, completely run away there. They they went for the turn. Get got the immortality up and Kilowash with the tap, with the lock in, with the instant kill. JP diving in for EJ manages to survive. Goes for the tempest of blades onto oh! Lusty. This is going to be Rebo on his own for the next twenty seconds or so. I don't think it's gonna be easy for him to defend two turrets at the same time. Bottom lane turret is gonna go down. Kilowash is gonna uh, relegating his. Uh, his roll there to the bottom lane, mid lane turret is going to be next in line. Goes for Defender Air Strike to zone out Rebo. This, could be this it. is this it. Could be this it, is man. it, man. Sun Sparks, they are going to the finals, and Brand Esports will be going down to the lower bracket finals. Man, the first 2 0 of the day just so happens to be the upper bracket. And of course, Sun.